This is Nina Curley from WAMDA Media. I'm sitting here in the WAMDA offices chatting with Elias Ghanem, the general manager for PayPal Middle East and North Africa. So today, PayPal is actually announcing the launch of its consumer accounts in Egypt, which is a very exciting day for anyone looking to shop online in Egypt who wants a secure payment gateway. Elias, can you just describe exactly what that means for Egyptian consumers? I think it's a great day for us, and but more than anything, that's a great day for uh, in Egypt, uh, where now consumers in Egypt can open a PayPal account on paypal.com slash eg and link their credit card issued by a bank in Egypt. And now the world is for them. They can shop safely, they can shop easily, they can shop on thousands of merchants around the world. I think it's a great day for everyone here. Fantastic. And what is your general strategy for Egypt? It, in fact, it's part of our general strategy across the whole Middle East and North Africa. We, a few months back, we say that PayPal now has a, a team in the Middle East and is looking to grow its presence. So that's one more step towards it. Egypt is a fantastic market. It's a huge market. Internet penetration is building up quite well. 80 million consumers and counting is a fantastic opportunity. Egyptian always said we want to be able to shop online overseas. Now they can do it. And cash on delivery is actually still very popular in Egypt. Um, and e-commerce is relatively underdeveloped uh, relative some, to some other markets. How are you going to encourage consumers to pay online? I think the problem of cash on delivery or why did cash on delivery exist is because a lack of trust. People don't know the merchant on the other side. People don't want to put their card information online, people, people don't trust it. Where PayPal stands for is really we are a trusted way of paying online. We believe that by informing the consumers how easy, how convenient, how safe it is to use PayPal when they shop online, will start slowly, let's be realistic, it won't change from one day to another, but slowly but surely, given the mind of the consumer that does are other solution than cash on delivery. On top of that, PayPal has a program called buyer protection. So if your goods are not delivered to your house, the merchant has not shipped you the goods, you will let us know and we will reimburse you. Now even better, if the goods that you have received are not as the same as, as described online by the merchant, also the buyer protection kicks in. So these two reasons, plus the non-sharing the financial information, we hope that they will give alternative to consumers to move from cash on delivery to more modern, simple, convenient, and safe payment online. How does PayPal plan to gain the trust of Egyptian consumers? I think the trust is gained by delivering the service. The better service we will deliver, the more consumers will first shop online, Second, tell their friends. Third, enjoy the goods or services they would receive. It's a long uh, mission that we have. We embarked on this mission 15 years ago around the world. More than 100 million active consumers trust us. I believe that if we capture the 80 million Egyptian, we will double the number. Inshallah. Um, so these, just to be clear with our uh, listeners, these are actually the consumer accounts. So this enables people to purchase online. You have not yet enabled merchant accounts, which would enable uh, e-commerce companies to withdraw funds in Egypt. Um, when will you enable merchant accounts in Egypt? I think it's a very good point, Nina, here. It's a consumer value proposition for the time being. Again, consumers in Egypt link their credit card and buy overseas. We haven't yet enabled the merchant in Egypt to open a PayPal account and start receiving uh, transactions. It will come, inshallah, very soon. We are working on it. It's part of our rollout, progressive rollout that we do in across all markets. I'm sure many people are looking forward to that. Um, I know we've asked you this before, but again, when will you launch an Arabic version of PayPal? Inshallah, inshallah, inshallah. I think we are working on it, uh, moving from... Uh, English language from left to right and from right to left takes time. It is in the pipe, it is in the oven, it is everywhere you want to be. It's being produced as we speak. It takes time, but uh, without any doubt it will be. It will be website, it will be also customer service. We believe that as we evolve and as we become more present to Egyptian as well as to all Middle Eastern, 
it's a must to talk to them in their own language coming. Absolutely. Well, we'll, we'll announce it as soon as it happens. Um, and what is finally, what is so special about shop and ship? You have a partnership with Aramex to enable shop and ship. What does that enable people to do? I think this partnership is a fantastic opportunity for everyone in the value chain. What people tell us each time I meet with a consumer in the Middle East, they tell me I have two problems when I want to shop from the outside. First, my card is some cases decline when I go shop outside. If my card is able to go through, well, as soon as I put my address, which we know how addresses are in the Middle East next to the, to the door, to the station, to the tree, does not fit very well in the boxes of uh, Western merchants. So the partnership with Shop and Ship is Aramex would give you Shop and Ship. Aramex will give you an address in the US, in the UK, in uh, China, and now recently in Dubai as well, which is a standard address. And then the goods will be delivered to this address. And then Aramex, through his knowledge of the ground, will make sure it delivered to your doorstep. We believe that this solution, this part partnership, will help us build a stronger appetite for online shopping as well as make sure that whatever you need it is available to you at the best price. Yeah, I guess it just makes the whole thing a bit easier. Um, so yes, and where can Egyptians find out more about PayPal in Egypt? So there are two places. The first one of them is, as you always, uh, www.paypal.com slash eg. But on top of that, we are doing right now something special to to uh, present, introduce PayPal to the consumers, paypal.com slash eg slash ahlan. Best place, right? On this uh, paypal.com slash eg slash um, ahlan, you will find how to open a PayPal account, why to open a PayPal account, and more than anything else, a lot of promotions available to Egyptian and consumers around the MENA region.